Hello and welcome to today's daily vlog. Now I need to take money in the garden, get her sorted out. And um, it's quite great today. I did hear on the weather forecast that there's going to be a bit of sunshine, but it's going to start dropping in temperature. So um, all the um, weather starting to get really wintry, which is good. I quite like winter, I just don't like the snow. I like um, layering up when we're outside and stuff with like my jackets and and stuff, so that'll be good. But um, yeah, I'm gonna take money in the garden now, sort a few things out. I need to do a few other bits as well. But yeah, today's looking good. Still no car, but um, hopefully today it's Wednesday today, so. Hopefully today or over the next two days, hopefully by Friday. Really hoping that it's done by Friday. It's been it would have been like five complete weeks come Friday. So yeah, anyway, let's take my in the garden. So it's now about two o'clock. Um got a few bits done online, but I'll get a bit more done in a bit. Um we took Molly outside a bit early. I won't give it another hour or so before I'll take it down again. But um, yeah, I need to mark some days off on my year planner. Because um, I haven't um, marked off any the last three days, well, the last two days and today. So um, yeah, we've spoken, well, we haven't spoken, we've tried to ring in the um, garage, but um, as of yet, no reply. Um, so we'll hopefully hear something soon, but I really want my car back. Um, I think when I've got my car back, um, we'll, um, do a few more bits in the vlog, because, um, Sean, who I did the shout-out for in Monday's video that you would have seen Tuesday, um, He's like, asked if I want to like, meet up again and stuff. So if um, we do meet up, so like morning before he goes to work or something, um, I'll take the camera along and we'll get him in the vlog. Um, but yeah, just generally get a few bits done. While he's looking at me now. <laughs> but yeah, um, when I go and meet him, well, when I get my car back, I'll arrange something with him. Um, maybe meet up for breakfast or something, like, try to find somewhere, like a little cafe that does, like, cool breakfast. Probably go there for a breakfast or something. Or, um, he has invited me around for a coffee, like, when I'm free. But, um, I don't really like coffee. So it'll probably be a tea. <laughs> but, um, yeah, anyway, um, I'm gonna get a few bits done. Bits done. And, um, I'll, um, talk to you a bit later. Little Molly just here is getting quite excited about something. And I think it's one of her denty sticks. He. So yeah, she's had one of her denty sticks. Um, just got back in from the garden, took her out just a minute ago. Um, and now she's left her denty stick. I think you want it? Um, but yeah, I need to do a few more bits online, and, um, yeah. She's kind of just spilling it now. <laughs> but anyway, I need to do a few more bits online. Oh, so it's now about half six. Um, can't remember when I last long, I know it was before, the way before dinner. Um, I didn't actually vlog before I went down to do dinner, but in the end, um, 
I didn't notice the time until about ten past five, which was a bit late to start doing um, jacket potatoes because of the quite big potatoes. It's going to take a quite a while for them to cook. Um, we was going to do it with like um, we've got some turkey mince, and we was going to do one with um, like a curry tur mince turkey in the jacket potato, but um, obviously with the time and everything, we're being a bit late. Um, I didn't have time to cook the potatoes because it would take about um, an hour or so so that the jackets are really nice and crispy. Um, so yeah, we didn't do jacket potatoes in the end, so I'll probably do them tomorrow. In the end, we actually had um, delivery of pizza. Um, we got um, garlic bread with um, cheese, mushroom, um, cheesy garlic bread with mushroom. Um, and we got. Um, Got it from a place called Danny's. So like it was one of the pizzas we were called Danny's Delight. And I think we got a vegetable one. I can't remember. Can't really remember the names. I think we got Danny's Delight and a vegetable supreme, which was really nice. Um, I haven't had pizza for a long time, so it was like a really nice um, change. We haven't had them for a while, but. Um, also, we've had some news from the garage. Um, my car's getting done okay. Um, they need to do a few more tweaks to it, so it's going to be done by, um, by Friday for definite. Um, they just need to. Um, I've got all the parts now, so it's just a matter of like tweaking it and building the engine back up and um, tweaking it so that the engine runs runs good. So, um, <clears throat> so yeah, that's good. Um, so I'm expecting it to be back by Friday and then next week we've got a car to do some little bits in um, I've been looking online at like um, indoor golf um, places there's one close by that also has an escape room obviously I wouldn't be able to film in the escape room but um, going in and then talking about it afterwards or something that might be quite fun, um, but obviously you need two or more people to do that. So I'll have to see if John, or maybe Sean, who I um, did the shout out for the other day on Monday, um, maybe he might want to come and join us on an escape room or something. I've never done an, done an escape room before, but I've seen videos and like little hints of what to, how to do them. So that would be quite fun. Um, but yeah. As I've get my um my car back on Friday next week or well, this weekend I might go to the um might go to the driving range again with John and um hit out some few more golf balls and practice my um golf swing. I've noticed in the um in the shed that I've got downstairs. Um one still got our old clubs are a little bit rusty, but I'm pretty sure they'll do the job. Because when we went before, we were stuck with these. Um, we borrowed clubs from from the place, and um, yeah, they were a bit. Um, they were well, they were, a bit, they were um, left-handed ones, and although I'm uh, I write left-handed, I play things like golf, cricket. And those sort of sports, um, right-handed. But then things like um, tennis and um, rounders and those sort of sports, I used to play left-handed. So I'm a little bit ambidextrous when it comes to um, like um, sports like that. But yeah. Anyway, um, I'm going to um, watch a bit of YouTube now, let my dinner settle. There's a show a program on tonight called um, Back in Time for School. Um it's a repeat but um it's like um a group of like kids from like modern day kids and they're going through like um what school was like through the ages. So that's gonna be quite good to watch. I think it's like um British war time sort of thing how school was during and after the um, the war, so that'd be good to watch. I watched the first one last night, like a 
think that was like Victorian times. So, um, yeah, it'd be good to watch that. But anyway, I'm going to um, let my dinner settle and watch some YouTube. So Molly's down here today. Actually, we just went in the garden. You know, we Molly. Took Molly in the garden quickly so that she could do any business that she needed to do. Do out there. That's all done. I'm going to get on with the editing now. And it's exactly 11 o'clock. Um, yeah, it's exactly 11 o'clock now. So, yeah, I watched um, Back in Time for School um, tonight, which was like, um, it's like a group, it's like a documentary sort of thing, where um, a group of like modern day school kids um, experience um, what school was like back through like time. And this was like an episode of like the years between the First World War and the Second World War. So that was quite good. And then I think tomorrow's episode is like the years just after the Second World War. So sort of building things back up and everything after that. And that. So we'll see tomorrow how school sort of like got on after the Second World War. And then I think... Um, because after that it goes all the way, I think it goes up to the 90s. It's all repeat, so I've sort of seen it all before. But I think if I remember correctly, it goes all the way up to the 90s, like what was school, like in the 70s, and then the 80s and the 90s. We're in the, sort of like the time um, before the war, and that was just after the war for the next episode. So I think there's a couple of eras before we get to um, the 70s, 80s and 90s. But obviously I went to school in the 80s. Uh, went to a private school in the 80s when I was like um, pre-teenager, like up to about 10, 11. Um, was it a private school in the 80s? And then in the mid 90s after living in Spain I think I told you about my life in Spain um, in the early vlog but yeah came back to school came back to um, the area that I live in now started back at school and it was like in the mid 90s and then I think I finished school in like I think it was like 97 1997 when I finished school and started at college so yeah, it will be kind of fun to see um, how that went about because I can remember getting like free milk and stuff at school in the 80s. Everybody got like, um, I think it was like a pint bottle and then it went to a carton. Um, what am I like, in like a half pint bottle? And then it went to like a half pint. Um, Thing, but yeah, I can remember everyone had to have like a bottle of the milk at break time. I think it was first break we got the milk back in the 80s. Um, it was like the last half hour of the lesson, the milk was like um, handed around every morning. I think it was the last 20 minutes to 30, the last 20 to 30 minutes of the lesson in the morning before you went to break we um, got given a bottle of milk and everybody just sat at the desk and drank it I think there was a few people that didn't like milk I think at my first private school everybody had to drink it even the people that didn't really like it were told that they had to drink it unless they were sort of like uh, lactose intolerance or whatever it's called I think there was any reason why they wouldn't be allowed to drink it um, but yeah, I think there's only like one or two people that didn't have to drink it. And I actually like, quite like milk, so I used to like look forward to it. But um, yeah. Anyway, that was like a little recap of what it was like in school was in the 80s. But um, we'll see how that show progresses as the episodes go on. 
anyway, it's now what time is it? It's the clock on off. It's now five minutes past eleven. I've been talking for like five minutes, so um yeah, I'm gonna end today's video here. So don't forget if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, leave a comment and click the bell so you always get notified when I upload new videos. And I'll see you tomorrow at 6pm. So don't forget, if you dream it, believe it, achieve it. Good night.